Welcome to the candlestick chart pattern course. In this course, you will learn about the candlestick patterns and how you can utilize different candles in order to do technical analysis. So uh, let's start off with what is candlestick. Basically, a candlestick represents the price activity of an asset during a specified time frame through the use of four main components. And the four main components are opening price, closing price, high and low price. So in the 18th century, a wealthy Japanese businessman, Mune Zahoma developed a technical analysis method to analyze the price of rice contracts. Today, this technique is called candlestick charting and is widely used when drawing stock charts. So here uh, I talked about specified time frame. So I'm going to explain it when we will move to trading view. So let's move forward. So these are the four major components of a candlestick. So this is the opening price. This is the closing price. This is the highest price and this is the lowest price of a spe specified time frame uh, of a candle. So basically these are the four major components of uh, a candlestick. So let's discuss these candlestick uh, components on trading view. Here you go. So these are the uh, four components which I am going to uh, show you here in the example. So this is the Bitcoin uh, daily chart. Here uh, is the daily chart and we uh, we have said this uh, regarding that uh, specified time period. So uh, we said that candlestick represents the price activity of an asset during a specified time frame. So here specified time frame uh, can be your selection. It can be one second, five seconds, three minutes, 15 minutes uh, or whatever, uh, you know, you select the time frame, uh, you can uh, you can get the data of the candle. So we have uh, chosen daily time frame as our uh, time period. And uh, here I am going to show you that how you can interpret the four components. So uh, you have to uh, first understand that there are two types of candles. One is the bullish candle and second is the bearish candle. Bullish candle represents that the stock price have increased during a specified time period and a bearish candle represents that the price have fallen down. So uh, here in example, uh, we are uh, we are talking about a bullish candle. So this is the opening price uh, of uh, Bitcoin. This is the closing price of Bitcoin. This is the lowest point uh, which Bitcoin has um, gone to uh, to in this specific day. And this is the highest price. So if we keep a cursor on this candle, we can also see the pricing here above. So the opening price of Bitcoin was 58588. Highest was uh, 51375. Lowest price was 4798. To zero and the closing price was five zero eight uh, three eight. So here you can see that opening was at forty eight thousand dollars and closing was at fifty thousand dollars. So uh, it clearly shows that the price uh, for this specific day, twenty third December twenty twenty one, the price of Bitcoin opened at forty eight thousand six hundred approximately and closed at fifty thousand eight thirty eight. So the price has increased and uh, this is uh, this is a bullish candle. Then if we talk about a bearish candle, it will be opposite uh, of the bullish candle. So here you can see the price opened here. This is the opening price and this is the closing price. If there is any wick above it, then it will be the highest point like in the wicks here. And this is the lowest point where uh, price has dropped down. So uh, if, we, if we keep a cursor on it and we see that the price of Bitcoin opened on uh, 50,701 price and the lowest was 47,313 and the price of Bitcoin closed at 47,543. So the opening price was 50, the lowest price was $47,000. So uh, this is a bearish candlestick and uh, this is how you, you uh, read the, uh, the different components of uh, the candlesticks. So here you can see also that there are two types of candlesticks. Uh, the one is the, the one in green is is the bullish candlestick and the one in red uh, is the bearish candlestick. So uh, here is the opening price. Here is the closing price in bearish candlestick. Here is the opening price. Here is the closing price. And uh, we we call this particular area 
of a candle as body this is the upper wick and shadow this is the lower wick and shadow and same goes for the bearish candle this is the body this is the body of the candlestick this is the upper wick or shadow and this is the lower wick or shadow if i move uh, to the trading view uh, panel here you can see this is the body all right uh, let me mark it this is the body of candlestick all right uh, so and uh, this is the lowest price this is the highest price and we we can call these as shadows or wicks so in the next uh, video we will be talking about spinning top candlestick